calling all sinners. For the Bible says all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Calling you the sinner, the Lamb of God, which take away the sin of the world. It's not the church that can take away the sin. It's not you that can take away the sin. It is the Lamb of God that take away the sin of the world. The Bible says we are sinners. All have sinned and come short of the glory of God without faith and belief in Jesus. You will die and go to a place called hell because you have chosen to reject the Lamb of God, which is Jesus Christ. The wages of sin is death, all sinners. You will die because you are a sinner. And the church cannot atone for your sins. You're not good enough to wash away your sins, O sinner. The Lamb of God which take away the sin of the world is the payment that God will take. Calling all sinners the wages of sin is death. But the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ, our Lord. The Bible says to believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. Whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Call in all sinners, for all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. The Lamb of God will take away the sin of the world. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. Come to God for God's salvation. Don't go to Satan for Satan's damnation. Because God's salvation is Jesus Christ. Satan's damnation is church. Do and be good. Baptism. Atheism are the realms of Satan. But to believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. To Jesus Christ the Lord Jesus Christ, there is salvation.
There is access to heaven through the blood of Jesus Christ, which cleanses us from all unrighteousness, that washes us of our sins. There is no hope in the Pope. It's a disaster to trust in your pastor. But there is hope in Jesus Christ. The blessed hope. There is eternal life. by God through Jesus Christ. There is, there is no salvation in any other. But the salvation in Jesus That only Jesus saves. And without faith and belief in Jesus. You will die and end up in hell. You will be in hell with your religion. You will be in hell by doing good. But you will not be in hell by faith and belief in Jesus. You can call yourself a Christian and still go to hell when you have not put your faith and trust in the one that will make you a Christian. The Lord Jesus Christ. I can call myself a fire hydrant all I want. But when a fire fire says you're not a fire hydrant, I can argue, I can debate, but he that knows a fire hydrant can say, no, you're not a fire hydrant. And God who knows his own. And without the faith and belief in Jesus, you are not a Christian. Without the faith and trust in Jesus and calling yourself a Christian, you are a liar. And liars will have their part in the lake that burneth with fire. Liar, liar, your soul will burn in the fire. Come to know Jesus Christ. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved. Come to Jesus, the Lord Jesus, and believe. Come and know God. And to know God is to know the Lord Jesus Christ, who is God. And by his death and burial and his resurrection and belief by you, you can be saved and die and be absent from the body and present with the Lord. You can know for surety your entrance into heaven. 
when the scriptures say, these things have I written unto you that you may know you have eternal life. And that eternal life is in Jesus Christ alone. 